And with Christmas just less than a week away now when the Omicron variant spreading, some people say they have mixed feelings about what to do for the holiday. Way 31's Alexa Scott joins us live from the hospital. She spoke to people here in North Alabama about what they plan to do. Alexis, what did they tell you? Well, some people, Brittany, they actually decided to stay home instead of getting together with their family due to COVID. But they did tell me that just that feeling of Christmas spirit is all that matters this year. Kids were having to go see their grandparents through like plastic blinds and things like that. And now this year, you know, we're hoping that uh, that everybody can bring their grandkids and great grandkids, their kids and have a blast. Decatur City Councilman Hunter Pepper says he understands the severity of COVID and knows what the pandemic took from kids last year, time with their friends, and most importantly, a lot of family. So this year, he says he's happy to know many are gearing up to be together once again, but not everyone is comfortable with doing that because of the Omicron strain that has made its way to Alabama. I work out of school, so I work with kids, and I, you know, I don't want to take nothing back to them either whenever I do go back to school. Jennifer Griffin told me this year it'll just be her partner and children and even though it's a smaller gathering she said the kids are still just as excited for Santa to stop by soon and to other families who may feel sad because they won't be seeing loved ones she has this hopeful message we're gonna get better we're gonna get over this um COVID spell I guess and uh maybe next year we can return to a normal uh family gatherings and all that as for Alyssa Turner, she will be returning to the most magical place on earth after about a year of being back in North Alabama. A lot of us, you know, got put on hiatus until COVID kind of subsided. But again, it's still a thing. And I'm just lucky to be one of those getting to go back and create magic for the guest. She told me she knows things will look very different now at Disney World, but one thing remains the same. The joy the children bring her and her co-workers every day. And that is what she can't wait for. They're the first person you see. And to me, it's all about making sure, you know, these guests have a magical vacation. And I couldn't be more excited to be going home and just having that experience once again. Well, as you can see, or as you heard, actually, everyone seems to have a very different or excuse me, a different Christmas or a different family gathering. But mostly everyone says they're just happy to be a little bit closer to their family this year. Now, either way you go, health officials are urging you to stay home if you do feel sick and they really want you to get fully vaccinated and boosted as early and as soon as you can. Reporting live in Huntsville, Alexis Scott, Way 31 News.